Elves most wanted stole tens of thousands of dollars worth of autographed guitars from the Oregon Music Hall of Fame. Tonight, the organization's co-founder is asking the public to keep an eye out for those stolen guitars before their induction ceremony later this year. Fox 12's Drew Marine spoke with him and tells us more. Terry Courier wears many hats. He's the owner of Music Millennium and the president of the Oregon Music Hall of Fame, to name a few. Since they started inducting musicians and industry professionals in the late 2000s, he's been collecting signed guitars. At that time, we were auctioning off about 15 guitars per year. So I needed to get at least 15 guitars. But I always wanted to have a reserve, guitars that I would go get signed by artists when they came through town. Each year, they auction off these guitars to give four college-bound students a scholarship for music education and bring music to schools that don't offer those programs. Their biggest fundraiser is their induction ceremony, slated for October this year. The scholarship program has probably been our most rewarding program. Um, being a board member, going through the applications each year. But over a week ago, all 70 guitars he had collected were taken from their storage unit in Northeast Portland. I had a gut ache. It'll probably cost thirty dollars to $40,000 to replace those guitars. This loss is more than just the dollar amount, though. Those are irreplaceable. Um, you know, I, I can get another Portugal the Man guitar. Um, I can get other artists to sign guitars. But a lot of the inductees are no longer with us anymore, so there's no way to retrieve those signatures. If you know where these guitars may be or if you spot any, Courier says you're in for a hefty reward. We're going to give somebody one of the guitars that we retrieve and we're gonna, we'll give them tickets to our induction ceremony in October. Drew Marine, Fox 12 Oregon.